Welcome back to YouTube channel Master Auto Information. Please like and subscribe to my channel. Watching the video, the Douglas DC-3 is one of the most iconic aircraft in aviation history. First introduced in 1935, the DC-3 revolutionized air travel, both commercially and militarily. It became a global symbol of reliability, efficiency, and engineering excellence. Now, in 2025, we are looking at how the DC-3 has evolved either thanks to modern technology, advanced materials, and sustainable aviation initiative or into a version that maintains its classic spirit while embracing the future. So, let's dive into the fascinating comparison between the 1935 and 2025 Douglas DC-3 models. In 1935, the Douglas DC-3 emerged as a breakthrough in commercial aviation. Designed by Douglas Aircraft Company, it was originally commissioned by American Airlines. What made the 1935 DC-3 stand out was its ability to fly long distances non-stop, carrying passengers in comfort. With a cruising speed of around 207 miles per hour and a range of about 1,500 miles, it was a major leap forward. Powered by two Pratt Whitney R1830 radial piston engines, each producing about 1,200 horsepower, the original DC-3 was a symbol of American innovation. The fuselage was made primarily of aluminium, and it could carry up to 21 passengers or more than enough at a time when aviation was still in its infancy. The aircraft had tail dragger landing gear and required skilled handling during takeoff and landing. But despite its complexity, pilots loved it. The DC-3 was robust, reliable, and forgiving in many flight conditions. The interior of the 1935 DC-3 was simple yet functional. It featured leather seats modest cabin lighting, and minimal noise insulation. Passengers could expect a fairly smooth ride, though the noise and vibration were quite noticeable compared to today's standards. Still, in the 1930s, the DC-3 was considered luxurious. During World War II, the DC-3 was adapted for military use as the C-47 Skytrain, serving in almost every theater of the war. It transported troops, cargo, and even wounded soldiers. Its versatility and durability made it one of the most celebrated aircraft in history. Fast forward to 2025, and we find the DC-3 still flying a thanks to modern upgrades and the growing interest in retrofitting classic aircraft with modern technology. The 2025 version of the DC-3 is not a new build aircraft, but a restored and modernized version of the original airframe, often referred to as the Basler BT-67 or modern DC-3 conversions, these aircraft are designed to meet today's aviation standards while maintaining the charm of the original. The 2025 DC-3 is powered by turboprop engines are most commonly the Pratt Whitney Canada PT-6A engines. These engines are far more efficient and powerful than the original radial engines, producing up to 1,424 horsepower each. The result is better fuel efficiency, higher cruising speeds, and improved reliability. With a cruising speed of around 250 miles per hour and a range approaching 2,100 miles, the modern DC-3 surpasses its predecessor in every performance category. The cockpit has been completely transformed in the 2025 version. Gone are the analog gauges and manual systems of the 1935 model. In their place, we find state-of-the-art avionics, including glass cockpit displays, GPS navigation, autopilot systems, and real-time weather radar. Pilots flying the modern DC-3 benefit from increased situational awareness and reduced workload. In terms of safety, the 2025 DC-3 has seen massive improvements. Modern flight control systems, enhanced devicing equipment, better communication tools, and advanced materials make the aircraft safer than ever before. Even the landing gear has been updated for smoother operation and better durability. Though many conversions retain the tail dragger design as a nod to the original. The interior of the 2025 DC-3 is also far more refined. Depending on the operator, 
It can be configured as a VIP executive jet, cargo transporter, or even a passenger airliner. Cabin noise insulation has improved dramatically, climate control systems have been added, and seating is far more comfortable. In VIP versions, you might even find Wi Fi, LED lighting, and luxury finishes that would have been unimaginable in 1935. Let's talk about fuel. The 1935 DC 3 ran on aviation gasoline, which was more volatile and less efficient than modern aviation fuels. The 2025 DC 3 uses jet fuel, specifically Jet R, which is more energy dense, stable and easy to store and transport. The switch to turboprops not only improves range and efficiency but also reduces maintenance costs and environmental impact. Speaking of the environment, sustainability is a big theme in 2025 aviation. The modern DC-3 conversions are often seen as an eco-friendly alternative to building new aircraft. By recycling and upgrading existing airframes, we reduce material waste and the carbon footprint associated with manufacturing. Some operators are even experimenting with sustainable aviation fuels, SAF, making the DC-3 part of the green revolution in aviation. Now, let's compare the roles of the DC-3 across the two eras. In 1935, the DC-3 was at the cutting edge of aviation. It defined what air travel could become. Today, in 2025, it is no longer a mainstream commercial airliner but rather a specialized aircraft used in remote operations, tourism, military logistics, and even scientific research. Its ability to operate from short, unpaved runways makes it ideal for missions in rugged terrain as something even modern jets struggle with. In terms of flight experience, the original DC-3 required a crew of two pilots and a flight engineer. Flying the aircraft demanded manual skill, as there were no digital aids. In contrast, the 2025 version can be operated with just two pilots, thanks to the automated systems. Navigation is done via satellite and autopilot can manage large portions of the flight. Maintenance is another critical difference. The original DC-3S required frequent inspections and handcrafted components. Modern DC-3S use modular parts, digital diagnostics, and corrosion-resistant materials. This makes them cheaper to maintain and more reliable over long periods. One interesting note is how the DC-3 continues to evoke nostalgia and admiration. Even in 2025, seeing a DC-3 take off turns heads. It's a symbol of a golden era in aviation and modern conversions only add to its mystique. Pilots often describe flying the DC-3 as a unique blend of old-school charm and new school capability. It's also worth noting that while modern jets have far exceeded the DC-3 in speed, capacity, and range, very few aircraft have matched its longevity. The fact that a plane designed in the early 1930s is still flying in 2025 is a testament to its exceptional design. Thousands of DC-3S were built, and hundreds are still in operation today I are some more than 80 years old. The cost is another area of contrast. In 1935, a brand new DC-3 cost around $80,000 which would be roughly $1.7 million today adjusted for inflation. In 2025, a modern DC-3 retrofit can cost upwards of $6 to $8 million, depending on the configuration. That said, the cost is justified by its specialized capabilities and low operating costs compared to larger jets. Even cargo capabilities have improved. The 2025 DC-3 can carry up to 12,000 pounds of cargo depending on the configuration an increase over the original, which carried roughly 6,000 pounds. The increased payload and improved fuel economy make it valuable for missions in hard-to-reach areas, especially in developing regions or disaster zones. Looking forward. The DC-3's future seems secure. With ongoing interest from private collectors, humanitarian organizations, and tourism companies, the aircraft continues to find new life. There are even initiatives to hybridize the DC-3 using electric-assisted propulsion, 
which could further extend its service into the next generation of flight. So, what does this comparison tell us? The 1935 Douglas DC-3 was a marvel of its time a leap into the modern age of aviation. It brought the world closer together, served heroically in war, and opened the skies to millions of people. The 2025 version builds on that legacy, combining the beauty and soul of the original with the efficiency and safety of modern technology. It's proof that great engineering endures and sometimes. The best way forward is by respecting the past. Thanks for watching the video. Please like and subscribe to my channel, Master Auto Information, for more deep dive comparisons and stories from the world of aviation and vehicles.